Hi, this is Sensei Nick Flores. We're gonna do the bunkai of Tomari Pasai. First of all, of course, we bow down to show respect. This move here, like this, it just means that you know karate, you know, you, you know karate is fist, empty hand. You know karate and you always carry it with you. You don't leave it at home. You always got karate with you. This is just, you step into somebody, step in like somebody attacks you. Punch me in the face, please. Bam! And then you move and hit him there. So that's that move right here. But that's what I did. Right there. See? Like that. Okay, we went. Bam! Now somebody punch me in the face here two times. One, two. And at the same time, somebody on this side of over here, get over here, John. Somebody punch me twice. One, two. It's just two blocks. One for two people, two blocks again. And the other one is, you come at me, punch. It's just a punch. Okay. The next thing is, we come up here. It's a block down this way. Somebody kick me. You grab his leg, and boom, you're going to hit something. Whatever is handy before he can punch you in the face. <laughs> it's got to be fast. I can't just go like this and I say, ha ha, I got you because he'll say, oh yeah, look at this. Huh? It's got to be just snap, snap. Okay, like that. And this one here, somebody over here tries to knock me down by sweeping my leg. Okay. And then I hit him and whatever I hit, right now I hit his arm, but sometimes I could have hit his hip. But whatever it hits, you break it. It's a block and it's also a break and move. Okay. And then we go like this. Somebody punch me. And then you stick them in the throat this way. Or a vulnerable point. This, that. The next one is just we went like this. Hey, stick them. Punch. Just a little punch. It's such a punch. And then we got punches like this, where you duck. Let's get over here so you can see the duck. Okay, here we are, and somebody punch. You duck this way. Okay, instead of here, somebody punch. Like that. White belts are the most dangerous karate people because <laughs> if you tell them to punch, they will. You never know what they're going to do. Trained people will say, oh, I'm going to hold it because I don't want to hurt the sensei. Which you can very well, very easy. Okay, anyway, we went duck, duck, duck like that. And then we go like this. I asked the sensei one time, sensei, what this? And he said, no one can see. And later on in the years, I found out what it was. It is, you feel people's energy. You can, you really can. I'll demonstrate. Come here, young man. Roll up your sleeve. Let me roll them up. Stay down. Don't roll them up. Everybody's got energy. And this is feeling people's energy. Okay, uh, John, real slow. Uh, and act like you're lazy. You don't want to do it. Just go like this, palms up. Go like that. Way up there. Bring them down slow like this. Like under your belt right there. But don't touch your body right here. Do that again, like, do it slow, like, I don't want to do this. Why am I doing this for, you know, no energy, put it here. Let's do it one more time. Go like this, real slow, like you don't want to do it. No effort, no nothing. Okay, he generated his energy. And what happens here, okay, thank you, young man. Okay, just relax. Just don't do nothing. Just put your hands down loose. Okay. I can feel his energy at 
at his wrist and between the wrist and the knuckle. I'm pushing it that way. Can you feel a little tingling or something? Yeah, he feels a little bit. But that, that's all it takes, just a little bit. And with a lot of training, you feel things like this, like that. In other words, you can walk into a dark room. I'm not saying I can do it. Maybe I can, maybe I can't. I don't want to by now. This way, you feel the energy like this. And ooh, there's somebody there. You get back and you kick out. Have you ever had the feeling you walk into a room or something or anywhere and you say, man, I get some bad vibes because I don't, you know, that guy, you know, looking at me or he's thinking he's, you know, I don't trust him for some crazy reason you never met him. That's because he's throwing energy at you. Anyway, so if he would throw a punch, throw a punch, you would go, oh, like that. In the dark. It's worked. I had it done before. Not in training, but in real life. Okay, so that's why that is feeling energy like this. And you gotta go real soft, like so. Okay. You, then you, it's a block here. A block, and then you just kick this way. Yeah. And that's just a block, like block punch. That's another block. That's all it is. And then this other one where I go like this and like that. Somebody maybe one punch with two hands or maybe he wants to choke me, I don't know. They go ahead, but either. I go like this, throw his hands up and I hit him in the ribs there, okay? And the other one is somebody from the front over here. Get over here. Somebody punch me in the face. It's just a block this way, but I'm looking over there at somebody. Okay, now the next move is like this. That one is like, oh, my arthritis is acting up. My arm hurts. My legs got a clamp, clamp, cramp. I'm 78 years old. You know, I'm dying. You know, please, I fell and I can't get up. You heard it, I hate that. <laughs> anyway. anyway my arm hurts too much and I can't use it. Oh, it hurts, it hurts, it hurts. But all of a sudden the guy punches. So I have to pick up my arm like so. See? It's just a reinforced block. That's all it is. And I do have arthritis and all kinds of other crappy stuff, but no big deal. Okay. And we went like this. And then we go like that. That's just a block like we demonstrated. And then we go this way, bam. Okay, somebody, yeah, just like you are there, somebody, don't move your feet. Okay, get over here. He, he's like that, and he happens to punch me, right? I hit him this way, see how it teetered a little bit? And while he's going, I push it, let me go ahead and fall down a little bit. I push him down, and on his way down, I hit him this way. So that's what this move is. Watch. It's just a sweep. Help him down. Bam. And then you do it three times. Okay. And then we come back this way. We went like this. One, two, three. And then you get back. And you get this way. Okay, you're right here. And yeah. He threw a punch and I block this way. Okay? So he says, oh, he's over there. So he punches me over here. I block. I get out of the way like that. Just get out of the way. They're like this. You're like this here. You go block. Block. And then we do the final, you know, touch this way. It's not a death touch or nothing like that, but with a lot of practice, you can learn how to do this. And the way you learn how to do this is with Ipon Kumite. That's an exercise, like, come over here, John. Okay, yeah, yeah, right here. Okay, John steps, punches with, punches, and I go like that. He steps again, punches again, steps again, 
punches like that. If you do this thousands of times, you in the dark or anywhere, you can tell people are attacking you somehow. And that was the video of the bunkai for Pasai. Okay, let's bow down to the audience. Thank you very much, and that's it. Cut off the camera assistant.